the 15 hours of being on my feet, I came back for them to say that there were 17 people dead. Have you seen the building? There's more than 17 people dead. And then I thought, where are the missing people? Where's the list of the 500 people that live in that building? 600 people that live in their building. Where's the list on the news? The list on the news shows about 10 people or 15 people. Okay, let's just say they show 30 people. Where's the rest? Where's the rest of the 500 people? Why is everyone walking around with missing on their, on their, where is everyone? Where are the victims? Why are we doing this? Why are we doing it? We're packing boxes. We're, we're sending food. We're sending, we're pack to who? They've died. So what they need to do is they need to pack these boxes and they need to sell them, not send it to Oxfam or Red Cross because Red Cross and Oxfam are not here helping us. This is the community that are helping us. So you're going to send all this stuff to Oxfam and Red Cross and they don't deserve it. The people that deserve it are the people that died in that building because they wanted to make it look pretty and it's an inferno. They burnt them. It was gone in five minutes. From 15 minutes it took to burn. Who's alive? Where are they? Where are the victims? I, I haven't met one. I've been here for two days. I live here. I haven't met one victim. I've met volunteers and I've met people that want to help, but I haven't met, I haven't met anybody, no victims. None of the people that I grew up with, I can't find anyone. Where are they? Where are they? This Go and sell it, sell all the boxes and pay for the funerals because there's going to be 500 funerals that you need to pay for. This is I'm not doing it. I'm not volunteering anymore. I'm not volunteering until I see, until I see some victims that I'm helping. That I, want. I came here to help people. Where are they? Show me one. Show me one person. Are you a victim? Are you a victim? Are you a victim? No, no one's a victim. Everyone's, everyone's here to help. My friends, all my friends are coming down to help. Pack them boxes and sell them. Don't let them send it to Oxfam and Red Cross who are not helping us. We have to pay for 500 funerals. Everyone's gone. Do you think well, someone should be held to account for this? Absolutely, the government. Whoever put that pretty stuff around there, that made it an inferno, and the reason that the fire brigade told them to stay in there is because protocol says stay in your, stay in your apartment. You know why I say stay in your apartment?